In this video, we will learn that how we can create a matrix report in SSRS. So here you can see I had already written a query. Uh, we are getting the employee information, the department name, the title as a designation, and the first name, last name as the employee name from the employee table. So our requirement is, um, here you can see, uh, we have a, a department name and designation and the employees. So here you can see uh, this data is repetitive. So we need to produce a report and we don't need to repeat this information. So we need to get single row per department. And on from the column, we will see, get all the designation and under designation, we will see the different employees. Right, so that we should know that which employee belong to which department and what is his or her designation. So let's go to the Visual Studio. We need to copy and I will show there what I mean. So add new report. So in this video, we will try to create a matrix report using report wizard. So next, next and uh, here we need to choose matrix next and uh, there are two very important things during the designing of matrix report the first one is the row grouping and uh, the second one is the column grouping so from the row side we will put departments so the department name will be grouped here and uh, the designation will be column column grouping and from the detail, we will put the employee name details here. Next, and here we need to write the name of the report. So it's a matrix report, or we can say employee matrix. And uh, the method is wizard, this one. Finish. So we need to expand it a little bit. We need to do a little bit formatting here. The designation will be, for example, we can put it this one and uh, we will bold this information a little bit and uh, we can also change the font color to white and the background color we need to a little bit dark And uh, the department name will be, again, we need to change the background color, for example, this one. And uh, the foreground color will be and let's try to execute. So here you can see. These are the different uh, departments. We can also write here departments or the department. So the alignment, we need to click the center and now try to execute. So here you can see, this is the department and uh, these are the different uh, designations. And uh, here you can see, this is the person name, employee name that is under uh, finance and the designation is the accountant. And uh, if you scroll it a little bit, so here you can see, these are the different employees, right? 
So all the departments are being grouped on the row level and all the designations are grouped on the column level.